Here's a little interesting uh, thing. So I'll show you kind of how the cams work, or the uh, cylinder head works on this uh, 4G63. So, I mean, you got your valves and your springs, it's the usual stuff. It's a, this is a dual overhead cam engine, it's got two cams. And uh, this is the intake side, and this is the exhaust side right here. And so, when the engine starts, it fills the head with uh, oil, and the oil, uh, and then the oil pushes these lifters up. So, uh, so, uh, and then um, up, up onto this rocker arm here. So these are the rocker arms, and they're roller rocker arms. It's pretty cool. It's got a little bearing there, and uh, so that's how it automatically adjusts. Uh, when the oil pressure, the oil pressure pushes these lifters up. And it accounts for that, you know, that gap, that gap you get when the when the engine is cold, you know. And then, um, yeah, so they're constantly adjusting. So no adjusting of valves necessary. Got it? Sounds good. And uh, yeah, so there you go. And there's uh, 16 valves, four per cylinder, and um, and this is a interference head. What a piece of shit. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. So, hope you learned something. He's gonna make it out. Oh, well, yeah. And, well, if you don't know how, the, like, a cam works, uh, this is, see there's these lobes here, and when, uh, when it's gonna push the valve open, I'm not gonna talk about the four-stroke cycle, but, uh, it's gonna it's gonna spin and then when it hits this lobe it's gonna push down on the valve uh, it's gonna push down on the rocker arm actually push the rocker arm and then which in turn pushes the valve and then yes yeah, like I said this is the automatic adjusting system right here pretty cool let's make out